In 2006, this small, beautiful country became the first in the world to have full access to broadband wireless connectivity. Sure, it's small and that accomplishment may seem easier to do than in, say, the United States, but that does not diminish the accomplishment. When many other countries were still trying to stabilize their connections, this place was at saturation. Hi, this is Rick Curtis, and I'm in Skopje, North Macedonia, thinking about what it means to be an early adopter. As an organizational leader, you could learn something from this country. Early adoption and decided action goes a long way with your clientele. It creates a sense of pride and buy-in, and it brings willingness for your people to identify proudly with your organization. It also puts you in a place where your peers can learn from you. That is not a bad place to be, primarily because it keeps you sharp, keeps you on the cutting edge, keeps you motivated to stay ahead of the others. If you know others are looking to you as an example, you will keep yourself ahead of the game. It's a motivator, a driver. It should be where you want to be. When you are driven by the resolve to be a lifelong learner and apply new information to be the best that you can be, it drives others to learn from you and be the best that they can be. If you have something of value, it serves as a magnet for excellence and it positions you as a leader of leaders.